Meet teacher Joyce. Like you, she's a teacher. And like you, teacher Joyce struggles in using technology-based instruction. But that was before because teacher Joyce is now accepting the change. Don't worry, she is willing to help you. Step 1. How to create Google Classroom And she will also discuss how to add learners, parents, your master teacher, and principal, and how to personalize your Google Classroom. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Teacher Joy's channel. So let's start our full tutorial on Google Classroom. What is Google Classroom? It is an online learning management system that allows you to manage coursework, organize and create assignment, boost collaboration to parents, guardian, principals, and students, and foster better communication. To create your Google Classroom, open your Google Chrome. Type in gmail.com. Then, you need to enter your email address. If you're a public teacher, I suggest to use DepEd email account because it offers unlimited storage unlike the Gmail account. Then, type in your password. On your account on the upper right corner, click the application icon to find Google Classroom. Then, click Google Classroom icon. If you cannot find the icon, you can go to classroom.google.com. If it's your first time to use Google Classroom, it will ask you to choose your role. You have two options, student or teacher. If you're a teacher, click teacher. Then, click the plus icon and choose Create Class. Provide your desired class name, section, and subject. Once you're done, click Create. Good job! Welcome to your first Google Classroom. To have a personal touch on your classroom, click Select Team and choose your desired image that represent your class. Once you're done, click Select Team. You can also upload your personal photo by clicking Upload File. Now, let us invite teachers. Click People's tab. Then click Invite tab and type the email address of the teacher for collaboration. You can add a maximum of 20 teachers in a class, including your principal or master teacher for observation purposes. To invite your student, click Invite tab. Then encode your student email address. An email will be sent to them, inviting them to join your class. Note, you have to require your student to have a decent photo and their real first and last name on their account to avoid confusion. If you select your student, you have an option on the Action tab. You can email, remove or mute the student. You can also invite your student using class code that can be found on the stream page under the class name. Click the class code and give it to your student. If you want to change the code, you can click settings and under general setting, click drop down icon and click reset to generate new code a notification will pop up if you successfully reset the code 
close the setting once you're done. Make sure that all your students have a copy of their class code. To join, they can go to google.classroom.com, let them sign in with their Google account, and click the plus icon and choose join class. Type the class code and click join to proceed. A maximum of 1,000 students can join in a class. That's all for this video. Click part 2 if you're interested in how to create and grade an assignment on Google Classroom. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and click the subscribe and notification button to be updated on the next video. Thank you for watching guys!